Ooh, boy, now that that's over, uh, hopefully this will be an episode that doesn't lead to um, an hour-long recording and a lot of, of uh, fun having, let's say. But who knows? I don't actually know what happens after this. I'm hoping that I'm not thrown immediately into another boss, but I may be thrown immediately into another boss. This is fully possible. What I would like to know is where the things that I missed are. Which is an easy thing to look up, but I mean, come on. Come on. Wow. Set the left arm of the Forbidden One. Oh boy. Isn't that something? Okay, done. Here you are. Wow, look at that eyeful visage. Isn't that nice? Oh! You have found my eyes. Yes, I have. Now I can see this terrible place. It's a prison of what I am and have been for so very long. One, listen carefully. In the most souls, in the most devout hearts, lives the seed that loves the consciousness and controls the will. They are the links of invisible chains that hail from remote, sacred, and forbidden places, from where the high wills dwell. Ooh. Which I have been protecting since I was banished from the dream. Here, take it. This is the true heart of your guilty blade. Ooh. Apodictic heart. I don't know what that means, actually. The true guilt of your soul. Enabling you to pierce with the hearts shrouded by the miracle's veil. Ah, I guess it's a good thing that I didn't go fight her yet then. <laughs> Chrysanta of the Rapt Agony. Oh boy. Yeah, well. You will inflict the greatest of all wounds upon her. The wound to the soul. The greatest of all wounds. Oh boy. <laughs> That's a fun one. Okay. That's not what I meant to do. I didn't mean to do that again. All right, get me out of here. Sheesh. <laughs> True core of the guilty blade, hijacked before the very birth of the soul. It transforms the tool into a weapon that can challenge the intentions of the powers that created it, completing the blade forever. It increases the sword's strength, making it able to fulfill its true purpose. Wacky. You know what? I want to know where the heck these are. And, um... The last three fun things here. But, you know, that'll be something for another time. For now, let's go fight Chrysanta. Actually, I get a feeling I know where one of them is. That's down here in a puzzle that I can't actually solve yet. But, you know, that's just the way that the cookie crumbles. For now, I'm going to go fight Chrysanta, I guess. There's not much else I can really do, huh? Right! Did I get all of the... No, I didn't. Hum. I contented myself to the thought that perhaps it is on the elevated bridge. But I had also contented myself to the thought that since I had already done all of the things, I don't need to do them all again. Because that would be redundant and all I would get were tears. And it's not like I haven't also um, committed a fair number of monies to the church. Okay, that was not the right, not the right lever. Fair enough. I have tithed a fair amount, and thus I no longer have any use for tears, which is not actually true. I also never changed out the heart on the blade, so you know, you know what. I'm taking the quick route. I'm very lazy, okay? 
I really choose just the worst times to be recording these episodes. I'm hoping that you can't entirely hear. We'll unlock the final phone of this world, meaning it cannot be equipped with any other hearts. Are you sure you want to equip it? Sure, why not? The mea culpa is complete. The soul heart cannot be changed anymore. Well, that's just wonderful. Let's see how... Okay. God, that is such a short blocking stance. You know, it's not me who has terrible timing. It's the people that clean the floors and bathrooms. Because every single time I need to piss or shit, they are cleaning the bathrooms, alright? And it's not like you can just go into the bathrooms while they're cleaning it. That's just wacky. So, you know, this is just bad. Yeah. I say yes. Alright. Time to fight Chrysanta again. Who's ready for it? I sure am. Ahoy! Yep. Carrying the guilty sword, you have committed the most serious crimes against the mother and her saints, against the miracle and its outbreaks. That I have. We have been entrusted with putting an end to your mission. Uh, have you now? I, Chrysanta in penance, excommunicate you, expel you, execrate you, with the blessing of our miracle of the greatest pain. Really? Thus shall your name be erased under the heavens. Shall it now? On guard. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. Try it, bro. Ah. I feel like this is going a lot easier than last time, but it probably isn't actually. Ow. Yeah, no, that was kind of expected a little bit. I wonder... I don't remember what my beads are currently. Alright, let's start from here. It seems like it's going a lot better this time. Okay, it seems that way. It seemed that way until I started talking again. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. It's going a lot better, alright? It's. I swear it is. All right. Okay, maybe not. Come on. There we go. Okay. I swear I was doing a lot better at dodging those up until now. Diagonal? No. Okay. Diagonal? There we go. Yeah, yeah. She loves doing that. I think that whittling her down with the the ranged blood attack might actually be like my best chance right now. Cause this seems to be a lot of what's going on right now. <laughs> Here, hold this. And it's not like I can actually hit her with those, because I always end up if I'm not close enough. But hey, it's working out. It's actually working out, like, really well. I'm kind of surprised. I'm just gotta be careful about contact damage. And also getting hit at all at this point. Might have actually been a better idea to just not worry about opening this right now. You know what I really should have done is, um... Change my prayer to the to the little guys. That would have been a, a really good. Oh, okay, there we go. Yep, of course. Come on, come on, little guys. You're like my favorite prayer. Die already. Keeler. Come. On. 
Here's what we're gonna do. All right, there we go. On the back end, very nice. <laughs> Ooh, new dialogue. I must escape the kiss of its steel. Interesting. From the eternal processions, demand that I should battle until I draw my dying breath. Well, that's new. The high voices proclaim that your execution cannot be delayed. Interesting. Is this a new phase or something? Not while their voices still echo. Oh, great. That was pretty... That was hard for me to hear, even. Oh, great. Oh, God. Um, what now? How the heck do I escape this? Oh, boy. Here's the idea, right? Oh, great, she does things like that now, huh? And contact damage, my favorite. I might have to change my Seta just because... I guess the prayer. It's not always a Seta. But I may have to change to the Seta just be... Okay, wonderful. I sure hope it starts on the second phase next time, though I know that it won't. Oh, boy. So, it turns out that, yes, I do have to fight both phases um, in one go. So, we're going to leave phase two for next time. That's right, I'm splitting this right in the middle of a boss fight. <laughs> and between now and then, I'll hopefully find beads and prayers, uh, one of which I know now I cannot get. But anyways, until then, like, comment, and subscribe, or I'll beat the heck out of you. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.